Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Today is week number two for Vita, which is every day in April. And this week, what I'm going to do is take this look and totally deconstruct it so you can see each step in really bite-sized views, sorry, bite-sized pieces of how you can approach this. So if you need just one little piece, you can go straight to that and see how it's done. Don't forget to like and subscribe and um, check it out. Thank you so much. Okay, so we've done our brows, we've done our eyes, and today, before we do the liner, actually today we're going to do um, concealer, because I think you should do your concealer and set it before you do your eyeliner, just so your eyeliner doesn't, um, just so when you do your concealer, it doesn't muddy up your eyeliner. Yeah, I said that right. So, my favorite concealer at the moment is NARS um, Creamy Radiance, and the color I use is Amand or Amande. I don't know why everything is always in French. I don't speak French. I only speak English. But whatever the case may be, this is the color that I use. And I really like to put it just for my, where I just have some darkness. And then I just kind of bring it out a little bit just to clean up some of the fallout that I got from the eyes. Eyeshadow. I don't really, I haven't been doing a ton of the highlight stuff. So I don't have the, a lot of, you know, a lot of the extra war paint type looking stuff. And it's just about maybe one shade lighter than my foundation, which is just enough to cover up the darkness. And I apply it with a fluffy brush. Always start at the inner corner of your eye. And then I like to just kind of blend it down and out. It just helps blend it for the foundation. Now, I don't do the highlight, but I do like to do two coats of this. Just to make sure I'm good and concealed because it is creamy. My husband just came home. You probably hear him downstairs. Blend it down into the side of the nose and down and out into the cheekbones so it'll help blend with your foundation. Okay, so we've got our concealer on and then if you crease like I do, you always want to set your concealer and I definitely recommend setting it with a, a fluffy brush. The same fluffy brush that you uh, set it, uh, that you applied it with. And um, definitely a back and forth windshield wiper motion. I love the Laura Mercier setting powder. If you are going to go for that highlighted look, then go with the Laura Mercier tinted, or sorry, translucent powder because that'll give you a little bit more of a, I guess, a lighter look. But if you want it to look a little more natural like I do, then I'm using her tinted, which has is a little brown. See, it's for brown girls so everything will look really even and natural so that's the quick and easy way how to apply concealer so we've done eyes brows and concealer if you haven't seen eyes and brows check out the last video come on back and watch the next video where I show you the quick and easy way how to eye how to line your eyes